How can we describe Rodolfo Anaya? One phrase comes up. Una fuente de fábulas. He's a fountain of fables. He is our child that speaks the words for our community. He is the adult that knows the stories, the godfather, the padrino. Rodolfo wants to tell stories about New Mexico because he thinks that we are losing our culture and stories retain our culture. We have literature, we have oral tradition, we have a folklore, we have a mythology, we have our own legends, and they're very important to us, and they define us. In other words, we're heirs to, to a great tradition, and that great tradition speaks to us, and, and it's there all the time, it's speaking all the time. The influence of, of folk stories and folk tradition and folk culture on Rudolfo Naya's work is, is quite profound. For Nuevo Mexicanos to be reading this work uh, is a is a it's a real special it's a real special experience and a very validating experience to, to see yourself and your, your people and your places represented in this way is is great. He is sort of a messenger for the Hispanic voice. Rodolfo has been a pioneer for other Hispanic writers, Chicano writers, Latino writers, by, by just staying true to his roots, staying true to his voice, to his culture. It used to be uh, Chicano literature. Now we realize it is American literature. I think Rudy has touched many, many people because his work has those elements that are core to the human heart and spirit, family, history, culture, the deepest roots of the spirit.